This is prime Dennis Siplenkov from 2018. And if he can somehow get back to this shape, then Devon, Levan, and everyone else is in big trouble. Was I able to trick you? Because this is not an old photo. Dennis actually posted this just a couple of hours ago. The traps, the shoulders, biceps, forearms, his wrists, even the veins, everything looks so developed and proportional. Or maybe I should say his right arm is looking proportional to his body. Because when we take a look at his left, it is looking half of the size of his right. And you know that the right arm only giant pumpkin training for this match is working for Dennis. And even his legs. He says that he doesn't train them, but Dennis Siplenkov's legs are also looking solid. And that's a guy that is weighing almost 300 pounds. And my assumption is less than 10% body fat. And while Devon is worrying about losing weight, he's trying to gain some weight. Dennis, on the other hand, has absolutely no problem in getting massive. Dennis knows people were questioning his current shape and whether it is going to be enough to beat Devon or not. I think that's the answer to those questions. And don't get me wrong, there is still a gap between his prime shape and his current shape. Clearly, he is weighing much less, not looking as wide as he once used to be, but he is for sure leaner and probably a better arm wrestler than before. And another thing that is worrying Siplenkov's fans in this Devon match is that he almost loses his wrist when he goes for the pin. It happened against John Brzezink, it happens against David Dadikian as well. But the thing is that he never loses his wrist. Somehow, he always manages to keep it flat and if that's the case against Devon as well, then this match is on.